welcome to the A&J Outdoor Baking Show. I'm Andy. And I'm Josue. And today we're going to cook salted caramel chocolate chip cookies. For today's ingredients, we'll be using the following. Flour, eggs, caramel, chocolate chips, vanilla extract, brown sugar, unsalted butter, baking soda, sugar, and salt. Alright, so the first step in baking the cookies is we have to whisk the flour, baking soda, and salt. You want to evenly mix it so everything gets through. Oh hey there, did you know that the creation of the chocolate chip cookie was an accident? In 1937, Ruth Gaves used a Nestle semi-sweet chocolate instead of a baker's chocolate, thus creating the chocolate chip cookie. Next step, this is when you add in white sugar, brown sugar, and your butter. Just... Now, now, the fun part, the mixing. First, use a whisk to start things a little bit. This is another tool that to help you out. When you're creating your stuff, you should have mixed down. part. After the mixing, you add in your eggs, one at a time now. You add in your vanilla extract. Next, you add in the flour. Next, add in your chocolate chips. Next, continue on with your stirring. Now you get your two tablespoon sized cookie dough balls and you shape them up. Now you add in your caramel pieces. Time to bake. Put it in the oven, 15 minutes. With the substitute, we're gonna use all brown sugar instead of white sugar. 15 minutes, yum. All right, so we just got done baking, and here is the one with white sugar. It's softer. Seems like not as hard as the brown one. More this gooier. is the all brown one. It's more uh, crunchier, and it has more uh, distinguished taste. Now time for the taste test. White cookie. White sugar cookie, I mean. Mmm, tastes good, it's chewy. Soft, you can taste the caramel, the gooey in the middle, crunchy on the outside. Now we have here the uh, all brown sugar one. This is a uh, more crunchier. Um, has a you take more of the chocolate, taste a bit of the caramel side. Thanks for watching. See you next week.